will advise you anything I discuss here is purely for entertainment and this is an experiment. So Tesla today, what, did, what do I see? I see that uh, there is a positive flow for intraday volume delta. That means a lot of retail, retail and small institutes institutions are pretty excited about it. Uh, please note that Tesla has more majority traders are in, uh, retail traders. And I do see some large institution outflow, 24 million. However, option premium delta came up as very big uh, uh, trade, 74 million. And at a gist, if you see here at a thousand foot view, there are some pretty heavy premiums flowing into the call side, um, buy side versus sell side. Okay, so if you look at this combining, so that's how I see. Now, if you look at uh, a lot of uh, uh, bull call spread, bull put spread, bull call spreads, uh, diagonal call spread, bullish, they need to be looked uh, individually because this Tesla gets so much option volume. So it's not that easy to tell right away. So if you go to just options, uh, let's look at Tesla today because Tesla, what I saw, the overall picture, they were buying calls and they were selling put. So OPD put positive means they are selling um, selling put and if it is call positive means they are buying call. So that is what I saw today. So this, this, is, this is an extremely bullish situation here, uh, but this need to be looked well, okay, because there are a lot of uh, spreads and those spreads need to be analyzed. But on the put side, if we see, they are selling puts, they are also buying puts. So this is part of a, uh, some kind of, uh, this is the same quantity, but different time. Okay, so we, uh, they may be, I see, okay, they may be entered here, bought food a large one and they did make little bit more. Did they make money? Yeah, they did make money. How many? Like two, close to 100,000 plus. Not bad, but the amount is pretty big. So they basically sold. They purchased here, they sold there. Um, that means they, the mark, that means what does that indicates? that indicates that these big large put buyers are not clear about the market. Of course, they made some money. You can tell me that they have made some money. There's nothing, uh, they could be day traders, but 5 million trade cannot be a, but uh, we can't say, Tesla generally sees this type of traders, but generally this is an institute because 5.1 million um, buyer cannot be small. Um, and, uh, so they bought it here, but interesting. You see here, when they bought, it was 288.94, okay, they sold at 285, okay. So basically they sorted from the um, peak. Then when it fell two, three dollar down, they just sold it, made some money. That's what it looks like. But anyway, so that's what I wanted to show you guys. That is how today, and they were not holding overnight and there are a lot of large sell put sellers. And uh, I feel this was a failed attempt, but anyway, they made some money. So therefore we cannot really tell the things. So Tesla is looking pretty bullish to me. And uh, let's see if we can find some block orders. Because sometimes block orders that I get the data may not be right. It was telling me that it was a sell. Uh, we have to see whether it was really sell or it was really buy and what time did they sell just now. So it's saying me that at open did they sell? I doubt that because could be, could be, I am not uh, denying that they could be large sort sellers. Let me check a bar chart. Tesla. It gives me some kind of indication if they were selling or something they were doing. 
Oh, I have the, I, I don't need to do the doctor. So, go to chat here. Press plan, go to zoom. Go on one minute. So, Tesla at the morning. I don't see 14 million anymore. The data could be maybe with uh, but but we have to see all the angles. We cannot just uh, we can anyway we can see something from the chart side. Sometimes you can see in a one minute candle, but many times you know you can't really see it. Because it's not too difficult to ask. So this is going to be not this one. Then we can go. There is a large buyer at uh, MSC that I already pointed. Let me go back to and go back to the open. This is one. It's not that big. So therefore, um, I feel that Tesla is still bullish. Um, we have to see how they do, but at this point I don't think anybody will raise short English one to be honest. The reason for that is people are so excited now with the current uh, election news. It's very difficult uh, to take this particular stock. 